Hey guys, this is James and welcome to another lesson of Adobe Premiere Pro free class. Today I'm going to show you how you can record your audio in Adobe Premiere Pro, how you can record voiceover or how you can do dubbing in Adobe Premiere Pro and I'll show you how you can edit those voiceover without knowing any advanced audio editing technique. So without wasting any more time, let's get started. Here I have already made a new project. To start recording, first you need to make a new sequence. To make a new sequence, you can just right click here on this project panel and then you can click sequence just name it whatever you want voice over i'm just selecting my own preset then clicking ok so this is my timeline this is a 4k timeline and here i want to record my voice over to record your voice over first you need to make sure your microphone is connected with your computer and then you have to set it in adobe premiere pro how you can set the audio settings you can go to edit then preference and if you're using mac then go to premiere and from there you can click on preference and then click audio hardware right click here and from here select the audio device that you want to use for default input select the input that you want to use for this tutorial i'll just use my fifine headset i'm selecting that one then clicking yes and the default output i'll select the speaker fifine headset this one right click yes then click ok now you have properly set up your recording device in adobe premiere pro let's record something right so to start recording you need to go here on the timeline and from this section if i double click it will expand right click here then click on voice over record setting this one click there then this panel will appear as we have set our input device so it is showing the input device properly and for some reason if you don't see the level then you can just click here then you can select the proper microphone from here right and then you can set countdown sound cues if you check that so when you are start recording it will play a sound on your headset so that you can have a countdown sound here on your headset right i'm just disabling this one pre-roll you can add pre-roll here so if i add three second pre-roll it will start countdown from three second ahead of my play hit right if i show you suppose i want to start recording from here if i click here it will start ahead of three second right so that is the thing again go here if you want that feature then you can just enable it or disable it then just press close or also you can just rename the audio i am just renaming it voice over then close now you're ready to record your voiceover. Make sure your microphone is close to your mouth so that it sounds better. Then click here on this microphone icon. If I press here, it will start recording, right? Hey guys, this is James and welcome to another episode of Adobe Premiere Pro Tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how you can record your audio in Adobe Premiere Pro and how you can edit those audio. So without wasting any more time, let's get started. I'm just pressing spacebar to stop it. Here you can see the voiceover have been recorded right now if i play it okay. back hey guys this is james and welcome to another episode of adobe premiere pro tutorial today i'm going to show you how you can record your audio in adobe premiere pro and how you can edit those audios so without wasting any more time let's get started so this is my basic audio if i play it back today again you can see you the level is here right the level is not perfect i can see the audio level is sitting minus 12 dB. that is not ideal usually you have to keep the audio level between minus 6 to minus 3 dB to sound it properly right to increase the volume of your audio you can just click here on this line you can see there is a line in between your audio click and drag it it will increase the volume right if i play it back but your audio in adobe premiere again Pro and how you can edit those audios so without so this is how you can increase the volume i will not use this method i'm just undoing also to edit the audio you can use different effects from effects panel if you go to effects panel if you don't see go to window then click here on this effects then this panel will appear from here you'll see there is a folder called audio effects click here then you'll see a lot of effects is here you can use different effects from here suppose if you want to equalize the audio you can click here then you can use parametric equalizer or 10 bed equalizer whatever you want if you want to use compression then you can go to amplitude and compression from here you can use multi-band compressor or single band compressor whatever you want to use but for this tutorial i will not over complicate the tutorial i'll show you how you can edit the voiceover very easily with some basic editing techniques right select the audio then go to window and from here click here on this essential sound panel right 
if you click here on this panel then this panel will appear from this panel you can edit the audio automatically suppose this is a dialogue track right so first you need to tag it as a dialogue i'm clicking here on dialogue after tagging it as a dialogue you will see there are a lot of options here first let's apply some preset so if you want to apply any preset go to here on this preset section click and select the preset that you want for this video i'll use maybe podcast voice or balanced male voice i'll use balanced male voice i'm clicking this one and now if i play it back hey guys this is james and welcome to another episode of adobe premiere pro tutorial today i'm going to show you how you can record your audio in adobe premiere pro and how you can edit those audios so without wasting any more time let's get started so you can see premiere pro has automatically add some edits on your audio if i show you going to this effects control panel you'll see Premiere Pro has added some effects on this audio track, right? So that have been done automatically. You don't need to worry about that, but you can change the parameters of the audio. Suppose you want to adjust the loudness, then go to loudness and from here, you can change the loudness you want, right? And then if you want to repair it, go here on this repair section. Then you can apply from here how much noise reduction you want. If you want to reduce the noise, click here. Then you can just select maybe two or three. If I play it back, hey guys, this is James and this, welcome to this is another after and this is the before. Hey guys, this is James and welcome to an if I show you this white noise, you can see there is some noise, but if I apply this one, the noise have been reduced, right? I will suggest you to use maybe 1.2 or 1.5% noise reduction. So without wasting because if you apply a lot of noise reduction on your audio, it will decrease the quality of your audio. So make sure you're not over using the noise reduction effect. I will decrease it a little bit more. Then I will maybe change the loudness of this audio a little bit from here. In any more time, let's. So that's it. If I play it back again. Hey guys, this is James and welcome to another the audio sounding great, right? And also you can use different presets. Suppose you want to use podcast voice. You can select that one. If I play it back. Hey guys, this is James and welcome. You'll see the audio is sounding different, right? And again, let's use make close up to another episode of Adobe Premiere Pro Tutorial. I can decrease Today the I'm level. I'm going to show you how you can record your audio. Also, if you want, you can make your audio that will sound like it is coming from a smartphone or telephone right if i select telephone preset from here and play it back hey guys this is james and welcome you can see the audio sounding differently i will use for this video balance male voiceover that is what i like i'll use reduce noise maybe one and then i will maybe decrease the level a little bit to another episode or increase maybe a little bit then i will decrease the amount of eq a little bit of adobe premiere pro tutorial today i'm going to show you how you can record your audio so that's all so if i show you the before and after this is the before hey guys this is james and welcome to another episode of adobe and this is the after hey guys this is james and welcome to another episode of adobe premiere pro tutorial so my dear friends that is how you can record audio in adobe premiere pro and that is how you can edit the audio without knowing a lot of audio editing techniques i hope you have liked this video if you have liked this video and learned something new from this one then you can give me a thumbs up and if you need this channel want to learn adobe premiere pro video editing then you can subscribe to this channel to get more video just like this one i'll catch you guys on the next one until then goodbye